Hello, welcome to I Love Stocks. I want to do a review I did back in November on the 24th on Tantec. Today's date is 12-16. We've had a nice little pullback on it from the initial pullback and the bounce back up, which I called a retracement bounce. And we're going to see if we can get back in this trade. But um, this is the video I did. You can go back and look at it. I called it a little pullback, but it didn't quite hold up to that lower support that I called and we fell down a little bit more so let's go ahead and look at the uh, it's a China based company based out of China I've had a little bit of issues here lately with China and their car industry they're cutting down on some regulations or something and, and a couple of other things but I'm still bullish on I'm definitely on Tesla but this seemed like a pretty good idea you gotta clean up that country somehow and these street sweepers is the way to do it and that's what they're coming out with. Look at the press releases. They launched the new driverless autonomous street sweeper, which I think is really a good idea. You got to know there's over 200 EV car companies in China alone, 200. And they announced their closing of their offering on the 24th. So that's why I did the video on the 24th to get that, that bounce that we wanted. And we got it. Not quite what I wanted to get. So we're going to go ahead and look at this thing again. We're going to look at the stock. And we're going to see if we can get somewhere with it. It has did have that initial bounce. And that was a great retracement bounce back up. We took it in the room. I didn't run it all the way to the top. But I did take the 50%. And I was happy with that. And then she pulled back. And I tried to see if I could find it. And there was a couple times where you could have scalped it. From my support levels. From that 184. Back up to that 236 level maybe would have been a nice little scalp and it's been a pretty good scalp there when it had that initial run but here we've had a good little four day sell off and I think a lot of other EV car companies were just following the trend and I think that's what happened here. I do have a low 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 support right down here at 155. I, we did hit that once and bounced up to resistance level of 184 but we do have a descending pattern right here. So if it does pull back any at all, I think we'll have a retracement back up to this 154, 155 level. If this 155 holds, maybe it could pull back to this other spot right down here. I'm going to adjust it to that 145 right down here on the body of this candle. If we can hold that 145, we could retrace back up to that 184 resistance and try to break it. And this is on TANH. I can see one more little pullback and then a bounce back up is what I'm looking at. If not, we'll see how Monday morning treats us. If it starts to bounce up, it needs to break this resistance level of 184 and get back up here to this part right up here right around the 222 area and consolidate in channel. We do have a low strong buy at 119, 131 for the second support, and then that first area, like I said, is going to be between 145 and 155 and if that holds we can retrace back up to 184 201 223 and then this 236 area and call it quits from there unless you decide to take off i am noticing a little low volume so that's not a good sign if the volume does pick up we could have a retracement bounce back up and that's t-a-n-h i wish you all a lot of luck i'll be watching this next week We've had a pretty good two-week sell-off, and we could start consolidate and retrace back up and find a resistance level again. I said right around past 201, 223 to 236, but it's going to be one to watch. It's based out of China, so that's my only thread about it right now. I love stocks. Let's go ahead and get back to this thing right here, and I want to show you. We do have a little Twitter link right here. We have our stock to its links. And please subscribe, ring that bell for future updates on these videos. I love stocks. Have a great day. See you tomorrow.